Hello everyone, welcome to this video on Snowflake's Snow Pro Associate platform. This is the new certification which is introduced by the Snowflake as of this recording. This is happening on February 2025. So this exam is close to around 1 to 1.5 weeks old right now. This is a new exam from Snowflake. We are going to discuss about how this new exam is going to look like, how we can prepare for this exam to some extent using my YouTube videos along with the exam content, exam guide and everything. In interesting thing about this exam is that so far the base level of certification from snowflake was snow pro core now they are introducing this exam as lesser complexity compared to snow pro core so this exam is going to be the introductory level of exam from snowflake hereafter now we are going to discuss about the basics of this exam. Basics meaning how this exam is going to look like, what Snowflake is recommending and all those details. This is a certification which will validate the knowledge on essential Snowflake skills like data management, AML integration, Snowflake Cortex LLM functions. Now I hope you can understand if you already gone through some of these videos related to the Snow Pro core, this AML integration, the Snowflake Cortex LLM functions are not part of snow pro core it is core on the snowflake the snow pro core exam is designed for but now they are trying to introduce all the functions that is the reason why they are calling this as the platform exam meaning the entire snowflake platform so with respect to data management with respect to the data integration with respect to the data warehousing with respect to the data science aspects as well generally cortex is more of the generative part from the snowflake so for this exam we need to be aware of all these things but to the very very minimal extent now these are all the things which is mentioned in the study guide setting up and navigating the snowflake user interface and snowflake notebooks again this is one important thing to note snowflake notebooks is the newer functionality which is introduced by the snowflake create databases stages and use of compute resources which is the older one load and leverage structured semi structure and structured data again the older one understanding the snowflake roles and data management this is also older one understand and manage snowflake account structure again a older one called snowflake cortex llm functions this is the newer one so very minimal new additions compared to the snow pro core but these are all interesting ones what is the target audience snowflake is demanding three plus months of experience on working with snowflake a platform before attempting this exam now let us see how the exam breakups and all these details are total number of questions is 65 uh, just a comparison study i don't want to confuse you people with lot of information if you already watched snow pro core you might be aware of the number of questions and all to avoid the complexity let me stick to this exam specifics alone so this exam is going to have 65 questions which is going to be multiple select multiple choice these are all the known things and the new introduction of interactive interactive meaning there might be a drag and drop type of questions which you can expect on this exam total time is 85 minutes as of now only english is supported passing score is 750 plus which is the scaled scoring method i strongly recommend you to watch the video on scaled scoring in my youtube channel itself validity is two years again if you see 100 usd is the minimal amount uh, previously if you saw for snow pro core it is 175 usd now with the minimal amount of 100 usd plus tax which will come close to 118 usd we can sit for this exam another interesting fact about this exam is that this is the non proctored exam meaning there is no online proctoring which is going to happen i will just show it to you via the certification portal as well once you enroll for this exam it is valid for one day within that one day you must have to go and give the exam without proctoring meaning nobody will be proctoring you but don't get involved into fraudulent activities and all give your uh, potential straightforward attempt this is the easiest exam so far so you can simply pass this exam simple math 65 questions in 85 minutes so you will get almost around 78 seconds per question how about the exam breakdown uh, this is again from the exam study guide which we are going to discuss in detail quite shortly interacting with snowflake and architecture 35 percentage is there identity and data access management which is 15 percent data loading and virtual warehouses is 40 percent data production and data sharing is 10 percent so this is again an approximated number not the correct number so rounding of 65 to this percentage weightage will give this much number of questions on these specific areas 
now what we will do we will uh, just go through the exam guide and also the certification portal to review these things there now i am just opening up the um, snow pro associate platform exam study guide uh, most of the contents which we already discussed this contains lot of details how to get to the study guide is quite pretty simple you can just open up a google and you can type the snowflake platform associate you will get the learn.snowflake.com link here this is the link and if you can do the just register now it will just take you through the learn.snowflake.com where you can log in using your credentials it's all free and then you can download the exam study guide even you can directly click here you can give your email id and then it will take you there and then you can download this pdf document from there so this is the pdf document which i got most of this information which is already discussed 65 questions 85 minutes 750 scale the scoring and all those things now we are discussing about interacting with snowflake and architecture the first section it talks about most of the basic things you can see notebook sessions run code using sql python cell execution status database schemas object hierarchy data loading query history object browsers these are all very simple and common things within snowflake coming to the identity and data access management rollback is there sorry um, rback is there which talks about role based access control role types privileges user uh, database objects like information schema public schema we need to know the basic sql st statements of exclude select limit uh, transferring the ownership all these basic details you need to know create the drop schemas all those things data loading and virtual warehouses again loading the structured data and then semi structured data and then copy into insert list uh, all these things creating the snowflake how you can insert the data and then again copy into is coming dictionary tables pre signed urls and there are some snowflake cortex llm functions of parse document translate classify text and complete functions are required so you need to be completely aware of all these things these are all common patterns of virtual warehouses how we can scale up scale down multi cluster warehouses all these details and then the data production and data sharing uh, typical snowflake marketplace data exchange time travel and cloning uh, mostly if you see if you are aware of the snow pro core contents this exam is a easy cake we can directly sign in and we can directly give that exam I I'm here to give this exam. I will surely post the video once I uh, give this exam and how the exam experience looks like. Right? If you if you can see the sample exam questions here, these are all very common questions, right? Most what is most accurately describes Snowflake. Uh, Snowflake is the data a cloud platform. If you see, it's all straightforward, very very straightforward questions. I don't want to go through each and every question here. This is not that specific video which is going to describe about uh, the contents of this exam and all these things. You just go through this, right? This is one important factor which I thought of. Discussing with you now. Coming to the next portion, uh, that is the one which I am into the um, uh, Snowflake certification portal now. How I can book this exam and all? If you can see schedule and manage exams here. Here is the manage exam session. In this, you can see um, there is this exam. Where is this exam? Uh, this is the associate level associate level exam so here it is snow pro associate platform certification i can register and schedule when i click on register and schedule it is taking me to this link where you can see that it's just a simple thing if you just click on agree once you click on agree automatically it is giving nothing there is nothing like an exam scheduling you need to schedule your exam and all so it is valid from i am recording this video on february 21 2025 so it is valid for one day you just proceed to check out you pay the money within that one day you can directly go ahead and give this exam without any proctoring that is an important thing which we need to know right now coming to the preparation aspects for this exam in our youtube channel there are lot of videos related to uh, snowflake uh, i am having a dedicated playlist for snow pro core certification uh, hope uh, most of the people who are following my youtube channel is aware of that so this exam is the subset of whatever which is discussed here only thing is related to the cortex and other reasons what i will do let me try to uh, create a series of videos for this specific exam so that you cannot confuse but anyway right whatever the contents which are required to pass that exam i will put it 
it in the playlist and i can try to put it uh, in the simplest form for the easy consumption right but there are some new things cortex llm and those things as well i will try to cover that and i will try to create a new playlist with the set of new videos for this exam but if you are already preparing snowflake if you are already working on snowflake i want to give that exam you can very well utilize my series of youtube videos related to snowflake and you can simply go ahead and pass the exam with the flying colors with this we came to end of this video i hope this video has been informative for you please do write lot of comments that will help me to improve the contents and improve the quality of my videos thank you very much for watching this video